Hey guys, welcome back to some more Cyberpunk 2077. Oh, get on the motorcycle. You knew you that well. Probably better than I know myself. He said when I'd had enough of the city, we would stock up on canned kibble, fill a couple of thermoses with coffee and whiskey. That's all of them. Sounds like a real adventure. Yeah. Oh, I guess if she's gonna get on her own. Why is everything shit, shit, shit? Yeah, I know. Look, you're alive. We've got a few things to take care of, too. Was I supposed to fight? Left them? a few peeps behind at the airstrip. Rest went with helmet. That's for my friends, you assholes! Oh, I, I guess it was optional. We we'll just keep going. I didn't see any reason in stopping. Honestly. They're coming for him. Don't worry. You know what? What? This is my life right here. I step out of one planet. These tracks lead up past the hill to an old filling station. I wager that's where they're holding help. All right, it says go inside, but drone trolls definitely set up shop here. I see. They must have helped. Buffy, see that? Let's see, let's see if we can't get. The pumps look pretty good. Not what you would find if the the bastards might have managed to call for Trent. All right, we'll do that later. We'll know soon enough. Oh, it says go inside. This isn't a very like. Am I spotting me? What am I even? Here we go. Drop any weapons and come out. I don't know what else to do. Here.
Come on. I wish that was like easier to do. Oh man. Oh man. I'm gonna die. Come on, heal, heal, heal. What? Why is this not? Barely saw that guy. Oh, I picked up too much. All right, sorry about that. I had to go through and dismantle some stuff. I don't show that stuff because it just it, it takes so long. We can't find something like a control panel, maybe. That's super easy to just shoot. Don't shoot, I'm unarmed. The hell are you doing here? This is my station. Name's Marty. Those fucking suits rode up like they own the place. Oh my goodness, Took what? Everything. See, I don't Put like this. Like, why? Why door. is there a bunch of stuff in the way when, like, uh, whatever? <laughs> I, I gotta say, like, just. Some of this stuff on this game is getting just annoying. Um, Don't look too concerned. Ain't my first rodeo. Once the dust falls, the problems disappear one way or What do I do now? OK, 
Okay. Where the hell is this guy? Alright, one second. Wait, what was that? Oh, now I can't get out. Great. Jesus. Who sent you? Hey, easy. We gotta talk. Who are you working for? You're in Obu Arasaka. Do you wish to take me back home? Pathetic rat's got nowhere left to scurry off to. He's out of lifelines. Shut him up already. Not a fan, I take it. You haven't found a fan in him either. Motherfucker doesn't know who to be scared of more. You or Arasaka. Don't take this personally. Nice. I seem to recall you were gonna tell Takamura when you got helmet. Yeah, just a sec. I'll call him. Just remember, you have helmet, and that's one hell of a card. Try to win something. Takamura saved my life, remember? Because it was in his fucking interest to do so. Still just biz. Well, he He's got no loud friend for no reason. <laughs> Takamura, good news. Got helmet. Alive. What did he say? Alive, alive. Not too talkative now. Taking him to the Sunset Motel. I will come to you. Keep him there until I arrive. You got it. See ya. Better take him somewhere you can talk in peace. True. Uh oh. That does not sound good. Looks oh. like your new chimba's in here. Okay, this is alright. Sure is. Take him outside. Toss him on the bike. Stay right there. The cavalry has arrived. Mitch gathered together a few elder colonies. <clears throat> the road was clear. I don't think we were spotted. We would still do better not to hang around too long. What do you plan to do with him? Trust me. The less you know, the better. Tell me next time, then. Uh-oh. Saul. Everything's done here. All clear. I heard Mitch is alive thanks to you. Thanks to V and Pan Am. They both saved my ass. I wonder if that's her brother. Told you it was worth it. That's all I tried to raise Scorpion. Maybe I could help out somehow. I think you've helped enough. I tried to stop him. Sure, just turn around now. Let it all be damned. You're good at that, aren't you? Look, Saul, it really wasn't Pan Am's fault. Careful. You and me are not buddy-buddy. Besides, nobody's blamed anyone for anything yet. Sure, right. Pan Am was just helping me. It was my doing. My fault that A.V. got hit. Without me, Scorpion and his people wouldn't have gone out to grab it. That's the truth. When you're an Aldo Caldo, you are always responsible for yourself and your people. The circumstances change nothing. Perhaps Pan Am should ask herself if she's still an Aldo Caldo. Harsh, man. Damn it all. Hey, don't worry about Saul. He'll get over it. I don't give a damn. But he gives a damn about you, Pan Am. As soon as he heard what had happened, he ordered us to follow you. He was worried something would happen. Saul? That was his? Look, maybe you two don't see eye to eye at the moment, but you're family, and Saul will do anything for family. The thing is, am I even part of the family anymore? You know you are. Come back to us. <laughs> I understand. Sorry you had to witness that. Things just get complicated. 
dramatic sometimes. But I will manage. And you, you look out for yourself, all right? And that's it. Until next time. They're coming. You yeah, I can hear it. like everyone talking, but nobody's Until mouths are moving. Take care of Scorpion's bike. It's yours now. Yeah, I think this game probably could have had a little more time, you know, to, uh, for them to develop, honestly. Just a little bit longer. Especially the stuff I've seen on the internet. Hey. Where am I? What is this place? I want to talk about your little invention. Biochip you made for Arisaka. Fine. But let's get one thing straight first. Yorinobu Arisaka didn't send you? No. This means you must have an offer for me. If your boss will pay more than Kang Tao, I believe we can talk. Nobody sent me. I got a problem, and you're gonna help me. And what does that have to do with the biochip? Hmm. I got Silverhand's construct in my head. It's literally driving me crazy, and I know it's only gonna get worse. That is, unless I remove it. And that... None of that's on the billboards I saw. Not even in the fine print. Constructed. That's impossible. Where did you get this biochip? Clepped it off Yorinobu Arasaka. Job for a client. But the client left me out and to And you decided the best place for it was in your own goddamn head. Actually, wasn't a bad idea. Construct rebooted me when my own goddamn head took a bullet. I always knew Yorinobu's plan would fail. I just never imagined it would turn out like this. Arisaka's prized tech really is in the very streets of the city. You have to remove the biochip from my system. It's not that simple. Look, you made the thing, didn't you? So where's the problem? If you're telling the truth, you slotted in a new experimental version of the biochip. How's the prototype version different? It's got a different engram, something more... Aware. Aggressive. The biochip is what's unique, not Silverhand's engram. The previous version of the chip was only used to communicate with pre-saved engrams. And it was rare as fuck and cost a fortune. Yeah. This one's rarer. Meant to install and activate the engram in a new body. When I left Arisaka, the project was still in the trial phase. Yeah, yeah, great. Your tech works. Now get it out of me. Well, well. I would have to see it first. Okay. I hope I don't regret this. Hmm. Unbelievable. It looks like... Can't believe this Seuss the one who's gonna help us. What? What is it? What a pity I won't be able to examine it fully. Yeah, real shame. You could have been his guinea pig, too. Tell me how to get rid of it. I'm afraid I have bad news. Your neural network has completely deteriorated. It can no longer function independently of the chip. The only thing I could Woo do... Woohoo! It's bargaining time is to give you information on a good clinic in Sweden. They'll help you through the terminal stages. Minimize the pain. What exactly is going on in my head? You tell me. What's it like to have two personalities? Because it's not like you're hearing voices. You are both yourself and Silverhand, simultaneously. I can see him, and talk to him. You're not talking, but yes, I understand what you mean. Have you noticed the Construct's influence on your decision-making? Sheesh, give it a rest. Know what? That's enough. You're just playing for time. Because I can't tell. 
Are you trying to convince me you're useless? Because, I mean, in that case, I can just shoot you in the head and save us both some time. Ah, oh, finally. I will try to help you, if you come with me to Kang Tao. I'll try, just isn't gonna cut it. Actually, it's almost like you're trying to buy your way in with the Chinese. At my expense. Do you even realize how much data is in your head? Even if I can't help you, the data must be saved. Well, fuck me sideways. Get Kang Tao. Right. Got any other ideas? If Oops. you think there's anyone else who can help you, I could give you the blueprints. Complete project documentation. Kang Tao offered quite the sum for it. You got it with you? He's got to. Gonk's fucking useless without him. Me. Hey. Takamura? What the hell is he doing here? He's got a few questions of his own for you. You play nice, he might even save your ass. I'm almost done. The blueprints. Nice. Hopefully this helps. Better than nothing. Long as we find someone fluent in techno babble. He's all yours. I'll give you two some space. I hope we can come to an understanding. That is certainly in your best interest. V, I will remember this. Nah, this heat. Uh, My throat is positively parched. Fuck! I will not give you a glass of water. Unacceptable. Be human. That is not You will see the difference. I will give you a Sit down, goddammit! No, uh... Oh, man, I don't like this. That the bio chip? Of course it's the damn chip. My silver handosis is clearly incubating. That appointed finger I hear in your voice? Fuck! That was your ticker. Sit and rest. Don't need your flatlining while we got a job to do. Blah, blah, blah. Fuck Arasaka. Blah, blah. Smash Mikoshi. You really are turning into me. Can't say I'm excited, because you're a manipulator, an egotist, and a cynic. Every time you open your mouth, you gotta bury someone. You know, we get along as the need arises. Maybe it's time you started trusting me more. Got no idea where I'm going. Be a living legend. That's all I wanted. Feels like I'm barely surviving. Test of a person's true value? Death. Facing it. Staring it down. You still got a chance to be somebody. Bullshit. Nothing dignifying in suffering. Death. Not how legends are born. What was it like when you died? What's on top of the world? Failure, not an option, not a thought. Till it happened. Death feels real now. It's only now I know it. Now? I had half a century to come to terms. Makoshi felt, I don't know, like sleep? Lacked awareness, had no sense of passing time. Didn't mark it. Did what they wanted to me. I just remember cold, a black void, fear. Or, or was that your death? Well, I think I get why you detest the place. Shouldn't exist. Of all the destruction and pain corpse wreak around the world, what happens at Mikoshi is worst. Know why?
They strip you of your right to die. No different than being kept alive on a respirator. That ain't the worst bit. Worst things when they switch up your identity, and you never even know you've become someone else. Corps have already taken the world for their own. Now they're coming for us. Let's move. Get back to work. Let's do.